All right, cat people, gather round. Whether your cat rules your house like a tiny furry emperor or just stares at you like you're a lowly servant, one thing is for sure. You want that whiskered dictator to live a long, healthy life. Well, strap in, because today we're going into things every cat owner should know to help their cats live a longer life. Because let's be honest, they probably need all nine to survive their daily chaos. Before we get into the nitty gritty, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Learn from the oldest cat ever. Meet Creme Puff, the record-breaking cat who lived a whopping 38 years and three days. Born in 1967 and passing in 2005, this Texas feline defied the odds under the care of her devoted owner, Jake Perry. So what was the secret behind her incredible lifespan? Well, let's just say it wasn't your typical cat diet. Perry fed Crane Puff dry cat food with a twist, adding in oddities like broccoli, eggs, turkey bacon, and even coffee with cream. Don't try that one at home, folks. Oh, and the occasional glass of red wine, too. Yep, we really don't recommend this one. But it wasn't just about her diet. Perry made sure his cats stayed active, providing plenty of outdoor time and a stimulating environment. He even had a garage theater where Creme Puff and her furry friends could watch nature documentaries. Talk about cat enrichment. Rescue cats in certain breeds can beat the clock. Here's a little known fact. Rescue cats in specific breeds like the Burmese tend to have longer lifespans. While most cats live between 13 and 17 years, some domestic cats can push the boundaries, living up to 20 years or more when given the right care. Indoor cats with fewer risks from predators, traffic, and infectious diseases usually outlive their outdoor counterparts. Gourmet cat food. You might think your cat is a culinary connoisseur, but guess what? That fancy canned food you're spoiling them with because you like the label? Yeah, it's not always the best choice. Cats need the right nutrients, not just something that smells like fish and comes in a shiny package. Cats are obligate carnivores, which means their diet should be mostly meat-based. They need high-quality protein and a little fat. Throw in some essential amino acids like taurine and you've got yourself a recipe for a healthy kitty. And no, don't let your cat become a carb lover like you. As much as they might beg for pizza crusts, carbs aren't their friends. Water, not wine, is key. We know, we know. Your cat acts like drinking water is beneath them. They'll ignore the fresh water bowl you refilled five seconds ago and go straight for the toilet or that tiny trickle from the sink. But here's the deal. Cats in the wild get most of their water from their food. House cats? Well, unless you're feeding them whole mice, and, um, please don't, they're probably not getting enough hydration. Water keeps their kidneys happy and their fur silky. If your cat's idea of drinking water is a game of, how can I spill this everywhere? Try a fountain. Cats love moving water. It's like the Netflix of drinking experiences for them. Endless entertainment. Or mix in a little wet food for bonus hydration points. Your cat might not thank you, but their body will. Couch Potato Cat needs a workout too. Look, cats might seem like they're expert nappers, but deep down, they're predators who need to move. Sure, they might prefer sunbathing on your windowsill. But without proper exercise, your cat can gain weight and lose muscle. And nobody wants a flabby tabby. You don't need to turn your living room into a cat gym although those YouTube videos of obstacle courses look tempting. But a daily play session with a laser pointer or feather toy can make a world of difference. Remember, if your cat spends more time looking at you like you're an idiot than actually chasing the toy, just switch up the game. Sometimes, a crumpled paper ball is all it takes to get them bouncing like they're on caffeine. Glamour Puss with Health Perks Believe it or not, your cat's daily grooming routine isn't just about looking fabulous, though let's admit it, they rock that fur. Grooming helps them regulate body temperature, spread natural oils, and prevent those dreaded hairballs. But sometimes, they need a little help from you. Yes, you, the one with the lint roller collection. Brushing your cat regularly reduces shedding, 
and prevents matted fur. Short-haired cats won't need as much brushing, but long-haired divas like Persians? Yeah, they need that spa treatment. Plus, it's a great bonding moment where you can admire their fluff while they contemplate your usefulness. Vet visits for cats not a fan, but it's a must. No one enjoys going to the doctor, least of all your cat. But regular vet visits are crucial. Cats are masters at hiding pain, so just because they seem fine doesn't mean they actually are. Annual checkups can catch potential health problems early, from dental disease to kidney issues. If you're worried about the stress of getting your cat into a carrier, well, join the club. But trust us, a few minutes of them meowing like they're auditioning for a soap opera is worth it to keep them healthy. The snip that saves live. One of the most important on this list, if you've ever thought about skipping the whole spaying or neutering process, let us stop you right there. Sure, keeping your cat's wild spirit might sound like a good idea, but you're actually doing them a huge favor by getting them fixed. Spaying or neutering not only helps control the pet population, because let's face it, no one needs a surprise litter of kittens showing up, but it's also a major health booster. Cats that are spayed or neutered have a significantly lower risk of developing certain cancers, like ovarian or testicular cancer. They're also less prone to infections, and for female cats, spaying prevents life-threatening uterine conditions. And let's talk behavior. No more late-night yowling or plotting an escape for a neighborhood rendezvous. Neutered males are less likely to get into those epic territorial battles that can lead to injuries or infections. Plus, with reduced hormones driving them to roam, your cat will stay closer to home, cutting down on their chances of getting lost or into mischief. All in all, spaying or neutering is a solid investment in your cat's long-term health and happiness, so don't put it off. Litter Box Mastery The part of cat ownership we all try to pretend doesn't exist. But let's be honest, keeping a clean litter box is one of the most important things for your cat's well-being. A dirty litter box isn't just unpleasant for you, it's a health hazard for your cat. And if your cat decides the litter box isn't up to their standards, they'll find their own personal restroom spot. And let's just say, you won't be happy with their choice. Scoop it daily, change the litter regularly, and make sure the box itself is in a quiet, accessible place. And remember, your cat is picky. If the litter brand you use isn't meeting their five-star expectations, they will let you know. Calm cat, happy life. You might think cats are stress-free, lounging around without a care in the world, but they can be sensitive little souls. Changes like moving to a new house, introducing a new pet, or even rearranging the furniture can stress your cat out. Stressed cats don't just get grumpy. They can stop eating, get sick, or start acting out. To keep your cat zen, stick to a routine. Provide safe spaces for them to retreat, and try calming products like pheromone diffusers if necessary. And hey, maybe toss in some catnip for a little feline me-time. It's like a spa day, but with more rolling and drooling. Fresh breath and fierce fangs. Dental health is a big deal. Cats can suffer from plaque buildup, gum disease, and even lose teeth if their dental hygiene isn't kept in check. Imagine eating without teeth. It's not as fun as it sounds, is it? Start small with dental treats or toys that help clean their teeth. If you're feeling brave, there are toothbrushes and toothpaste specifically designed for cats, though good luck convincing your cat that brushing is cool. In any case, a little effort now can prevent major dental problems later. Love them for who they are, even if they're weird. Last but not least, the key to a long, happy cat life. Understanding your cat is a weird, lovable, moody ball of fluff, and accepting that. They're not dogs. They won't fetch your slippers or greet you at the door like they've been waiting all day. But that's okay. They've got their own way of showing they care, like sitting just out of reach when you want to pet them, or gifting you a dead mouse, or more likely a crumpled receipt they found under the couch. 
Celebrate your cat's quirks and enjoy the fact that they're their own creature. Your home wouldn't be the same without them. Hungry for more hilarious and helpful cat wisdom? Don't go anywhere. Stick around for the next video. And remember, hit that like button and subscribe for more furry shenanigans and tips to keep your whiskered ruler happy. Thanks for watching.